Hello, would you like to be a better data storyteller? Well, I do, I would too. And I spend a lot of time like you in virtual meetings with customers and colleagues. And what I don't want is to be a tiny thumbnail down in the corner while all the data's somewhere untouchable. I would rather be infused with the data. So let's touch the tabloid sparkle and see what happens. Well, I have data and this data is about flood risk and population in the Netherlands, including where my employees and colleagues live and work. So we'll take province and population and create a sorted bar chart that I can touch with and interact with straight away. I can see the range of values and discuss the insights we get from that. And if we add flood risk, the bar chart gets resorted. And now the orange bars show flood risk in each of these provinces. You can see it's only 10% in uh, North Holland, whereas in South Holland, that flood risk rises to about 43% of the population. So it's a significant difference depending on where you live. And incidentally, I actually wasn't an expert on these provinces before doing this uh, demonstration. So why don't we get, get the province and take a look where, the, where they all are. Here we go. South Holland, Utrecht, North Holland, we can see our data come to life. And by the way, this is commodity webcam in and off the shelf laptop. We don't need special technology to augment our own realities. Finally, let's see where my employees uh, in the Netherlands are, my colleagues. And we can see the big white dot shows that most employees are in North Holland, whereas South Holland, where the risk was significant, there aren't very many employees. We can bring this data into the conversation and I can compare that employee heavy province here in North Holland with the employee sparse province where the flood risk is higher. If you want to compare flood risk, that's fine. Population, that's fine. And this is data infused in the conversation and we can bring data to life with what we're calling tableau gestures.